I, I hear you've got a, a tour coming up. Um, I'd love to hear a little bit about uh, what sort of music you're gonna be featuring on the tour and where you're headed. Yeah, yeah, we're really excited actually. Uh, we start our tour at the end of February and uh, doing a full US tour. And then we take a, a little break and then you know scoot on over to Europe and overseas. And yeah, so so we'll be touring uh, the Love Made Me Do It album and um, pr pretty excited. <laughs> yeah, so do you have a favorite track from that album? Um, you know, I since I wrote the songs to me, they all have meanings that I, you know, that I respond to for different reasons. But I think as far as like performing them, you know, like some of my favorite songs to perform are, are, are Fear You. I think that's one of the songs that's just like, um, I noticed that's one that people like to sing along to a lot and I love like, you know, anytime you have interaction with people in the crowd, it's always uh, it's always an amazing thing. So yeah, um, but you know, I love tracks like I Am Nothing and Banish, even though they're more melancholy and, and quiet, um, those kind of just like pull on my heartstrings more than others. Is that, the, what, when was the moment that you first really got into music? Was that, was that around that time that you? Um, well, I mean, I was actually introduced to music at an early age. I've been playing classical music since I was five years old. So, you know, I think a lot of people know me from the tattoo world or from the TV shows and stuff, but um, they don't know that like music has always been my first and foremost biggest passion. Uh, so it's exciting to finally be able to like make this my main focus and, you know, create music and then play it live. Yeah, yeah. So how has your sound evolved and um, how would you, how would you say it's gone on this journey from, you said you were into classical music as a child. Yeah. And, and what is it, you know, maybe in, earlier on in your career and what is it now? Well, I mean, I think a lot of people, when I announced that I was coming out with music, they were assuming that it was going to be like something in the world of metal, just because, you know, I love metal. I've, uh, you know, been in that scene for a long time, but I don't sing that way either. <laughs> so I'm like, I think I would take, make a terrible heavy metal singer, but you know, um, some of my favorite genres of music is really in the post-punk world. So I love bands like Susie and the Banshees and The Cure and Depeche Mode. And, um, you know, I've always been a fan of analog synthesizers and the nostalgic sounds of of synths. And so I, that's that's why I chose to go in that direction. It's like, that, that's those are some of my favorite sounds and, and giving it a modern twist to me is like, it's the ultimate high. So, yeah.